Hello my YouTube beauties and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do my April favorites. April has been such a great month. Um, I had my birthday in April, so now I'm 22. So over this last month, I have been using a ton of things that I have been loving. So I want to share that with you guys. <laughs> so the first random object I have to share with you guys are these shoes. Um, I received these beautiful shoes for my birthday um, from my boyfriend, Chris. These are the Mark Fisher shoes. This is what one of them looks like. Really pretty, really strappy. Um, they're about three inch heels, so they're not super tall. And me being a five foot nine, I do not like super tall heels. Um, I don't feel like I need them. So I have been loving these shoes. Actually, these are probably the prettiest shoes I own. So the next two items that I have to share with you guys are uh, fragrances. So I have two of them. And the first one is the Lancome. I have no idea how to say this. La Ve Est Belle. So fun fact, the lady at Sephora actually told me that the bottom of this bottle is um, the way that Julia Roberts' uh, lips are shaped. I don't know why. I don't know if this was like a selling point for her. Just a fun fact. This is a 3.4 ounce bottle and I'm looking up the notes for you guys. It's really sophisticated sexy. So the notes are iris, patchouli, and gourmand. The style is uh, free, happy, addictive. It has floral notes of sambac, jasmine, and tuscanian orange blossom. This smells so good. It's more of a sophisticated scent. A little bit does go a long way, so you only need one spray. I accidentally sprayed like two times too many uh, the first time that I tried it because this is a perfume. This is not a toilette, so this is my first actual perfume. And for those of you who do not know, perfumes are stronger than toilettes. So when I sprayed this all over my body, I was like soaked in it. I had to change. It was horrible. If you just do a light spritz on your body, it stays all day long and it smells really good. In addition to the bottle, I got this box that it came in. They talked me into buying this like deal. This was $112 and it comes with the um, or with the fragrance that I just showed you, this roller ball and then a, um, a lotion for it. So I think this box is really pretty. The next fragrance I have is the Marc Jacobs Decadence. This is what it looks like. I love, I love it. How cute is that? It's got a little tassel on it. This is a big bulky perfume. Now this is more of a dark sultry. That one was a little bit lighter. The notes, there's a lot of notes in here. Um, Italian plum, iris flower, saffron, Bulgar Bulgarian rose, jasmine, sambac, orris, velvet, papyrus, woods, and liquid amber. It says qualitative, opulent, and surprising is the style. There's a lot of layers to this perfume and it almost smells fruity, but really warm. I don't know, I love it. It smells really good. Again, just a light hand when using these. The next couple items are makeup items. So I guess I'll start with this guy. This is a brush um, from Tarte. This is their bamboo foundation brush. It is shaped like a square and I love this for foundation. It's really soft. It's packed and it's dense, but it's not too dense where you can't move the brush around. See how I'm easily bending the bristles? This is so soft and I find that my foundation goes on a lot quicker with such a big brush size. So I have been loving this. The next item I have is a setting spray. This is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Setting Spray. I saw Kathleen Lights talk about this in one of her recent videos, so I immediately went out and bought it. And it's just a, it's small, so it's only one and a half ounces. So for a setting spray, I would think that's kind of small compared to like my huge Bosho one. But this works. Holy crap. This keeps your makeup on for such a long time. I I think I put my makeup on at like seven o'clock in the morning the other day and I I set my um, set my makeup with this spray and I looked at nine o'clock at night and my bronzer, my blush, my highlight, everything was still there and normally it rubs off throughout the day. So I was really, really pleasantly surprised with this product and it's at the drugstore and it's really affordable so you can't go wrong. Oh, 
that felt good my back just cracked so this is the smashbox photo finish foundation primer i have never tried this it reminds me a lot of it almost has a smoothing feeling kind of like the hourglass veil primer and this is just a mini size sample but it is so good it makes my foundation last a really long time and i love the way that it applies when i'm using this primer so that's a favorite ah, i dropped it the next favorite i have is the tarts tartist uh, lash paint and this is a sample size again I live off of samples because it just uh, it makes me decide whether I want to buy the full one or not so this you know I don't know how the full like I already bought the full size but I don't know how the full size closes like you'll see in a second but this just like comes off Whew, a lot of product there but the sample size it doesn't screw on so I think that's a little odd it just kind of like pulls out I'm not sure how that's gonna keep the lash or the mascara lasting a long time but who knows this may just be a sample weird size but this makes my lap this is the closest thing to the covergirl mascara that I use the purple one I am ride or die for that mascara I don't use other mascaras because I love the way that makes my lashes look and it's not waterproof it's easy to get off I'm the most picky about my uh, my mascara and the way that my lashes look I like volume I like length I like separating and I can't find a mascara that does all of that until this one this separates and lengthens a little bit more than it does volumize really really good mascara the next set i got is from mark jacobs and it's these little highliner deals there are three different colors so there's dark navy a teal and kind of a cranberry these guys are so good and they're mini in my experience with the highliners i never run out of product i it dries up before i get to the end of the product i thought maybe having these little guys instead of buying buying the full size was a good idea this little set was 25 dollars, i believe and the normal one is 25 dollars, like a long one i shall swatch them for you really creamy like look at that navy it's so pretty and then this one is the teal one i know it's really pretty just a heads up these are more metallic so if you don't like metallic colors you will not like this i mean those three colors are to die for what i've been doing is using like the using matte shadows just in my outer corner not doing any eyeshadow and just putting a pop of color like these on my waterline last two items i have uh the first one is the l'oreal true match lumi cushion this is the luminous foundation and i know all of you out there are saying but you're oily why do you want a luminous foundation well i'll tell you so it opens like this and it has a mirror I took the little stupid thing out and there's the product right there and it you touch it on your finger and it's just like a cushy foundation and it comes off like that i think this is beautiful for a lighter coverage since it's been getting more hot here in colorado i have not wanted um, a really heavy matte foundation i don't really like the fact that this is more luminous because i feel like i can powder it and make it matte looking and natural but this is just a lighter coverage foundation and honestly i'm gonna do a video here in a couple weeks my foundation declutter and this isn't going anywhere because this is beautiful i use it with a um a beauty blender or a real technique sponge i don't like to use it with a brush because that's just weird putting a brush in a sponge this is the wet and wild one step wonder gel in pretty peas and this is what i have on my nails today I don't do my nails that often just because it doesn't last, but this stuff lasts. I painted my nails almost four days ago and I, they have not chipped at all. So I am really pleased with this. I love the formula. I love the color. Everyone's been complimenting me on my nails and I'm like, this is a definite favorite. So that is all I have for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate your support. Give it a thumbs up if you liked this video and comment down below. Let me know what your favorites are because that's how we communicate. That's how we talk. That's how we get to know each other. Please subscribe if you have not already and I will see you guys later in my next video. Bye.